Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Scott, once again here on the In My Life channel. I would like to start off by saying Happy New Year to all of you. I know I'm late, but it has in fact been one month since I brought you a video on this channel. Now things are gonna be changing in 2016, and this video specifically is my goals for 2016 and past 2016, so in life in general. Now I don't have a schedule for this channel yet, but it will be changing as of this week. Now if you guys do enjoy this video, be sure to thumbs it up. I'm so close to 5,000 subscribers, which is pretty awesome. So I'm gonna start off this video with talking a little bit about myself. However, if you would like to know even more, I did do a 22 facts about me, which I will link down below. So the first thing I wanna teach you is that I am in fact not a planner. I live day by day. Now, this hasn't always been the way I lived. I used to just live with plans and specific dates and specific schedules, but that absolutely drives me crazy. So I'm a person who lives day by day. Even when I wake up in the morning, I'm like, okay, new day. What videos am I going to be doing? So many of you guys do know me as Echo Soldier or Echo or the guy who plays Minecraft a lot. But I've always wanted people to know me more on a personal level, which is why this is called In My Life. Now I'm gonna be teaching you guys pretty much about me from when I was a little bit younger. So when I was in school, I was I was never the smartest kid ever. Um, I used to skip school a lot. I spent a lot of my time just playing football. I was that guy who just loved sports. It was everyday football. If you're in the US, that's soccer. I lived, I breathed, and I slept football. That was just who I was and that's absolutely what I loved. Now, besides me loving football, I always had a passion for gaming and this is where I was slightly different from other people uh, because my friends, they lived, they breathed, they slept football as well. But on the side, I had an even balance of gaming and football. I would go out and play a lot of football and then I'd come home and play a lot of gaming and this could be from gaming from like 10 o'clock at night up until like 10 o'clock at night the next day, so full gaming sessions of Call of Duty and other games as well. Now, what I'm trying to say to you is that what I did when I was younger in terms of playing games is I kept games more of a hidden secret from pretty much everyone. This would be my family, my friends, my girlfriends, because I don't know, when I was a little bit younger, I guess gaming was classed as nerdy, it was classed as, oh, the geeks play games and stuff like that. Now, in this day and age, things have changed, whether it's because I've grown older and I understand a little bit more, I have no idea. And even to this day, because I do YouTube full time, YouTube is my job along with streaming, trying to explain it to new people is very, very hard. Um, and I am i wouldn't say I'm embarrassed, but it's very hard to explain to a new girlfriend. It's very hard to explain to people you don't know what you do for a living because a lot of people see, what, what people don't understand, they see it as stupid. So if someone doesn't understand what I do every day, they think it's stupid. And I really don't want people to ever think of that. Now, I do have an inspirational quote that I've used for as long as I can remember and for as long as I've been making YouTube videos. And this is the specific quote I live by. And it says, who do you notice more? Now basically it's being different from others. And I guess if you stand out, you're more likely, I wouldn't say to be noticed, but I guess the people who break away from being a sheep, they seem to be more successful and they seem to be a lot happier. Now I am the happiest in my life that I've ever been in years. And being away from what people think in society you should do, it's one of the best things I've ever done in my life. Uh, because when I was in school, uh, a lot of people wanted to go to sixth form, which is in the UK, which is like after school. I went straight to college. A lot of my friends wanted to go to university. I went to college. They either didn't finish university or they finished university and they've done absolutely nothing with it apart from getting themselves in debt. Now, people always want to see you succeed. People always want to see you succeed, but never more than them. Now remember that there's only a few minor people who will always want you to succeed past them and they're the real people to keep in your life. Now I know I'm rambling on a little bit, but I kind of want to explain to you how my goals came about. Now I'm 22 years old and my goals for this year, 
Um, a lot of them do focus around YouTube, but also like adult stuff. Now, I'm hoping at the end of this year I can just buy my house and not have to worry at all and just have just have a house. I have a place that I can say this is my house. I own this house. Um, and I kind of just want to keep going on enjoying what I'm doing, having the freedom and having the things that I have now is all thanks to you guys who watch my videos. Um, so my goals for 2016, I guess to just focus past 2016 in a way, but for YouTube, maybe this channel, I want to try and possibly hit 100,000. Maybe that's gonna be possible, maybe it's not. For my main channel, I want to say 700,000 subscribers, uh, which is pretty much double of what I have now. I'm close to 400,000, so that's on Echo Soldier. Um, on my Twitch, I would say 50,000 followers, um, and then other goals, I really, I can't really think of other goals in 2016. A lot of them evolve around YouTube because YouTube has been my life for as long as I can remember. I guess my goals are to try and be as successful as I can. Everyone wants to be successful. Success doesn't necessarily mean money in life. It's just being successful at what you do. And that's how I'm seeing things. And my life goals are to be even more successful, to be comfortable in terms of money to give my family everything they need and they deserve, uh, to live a comfortable life and just, just be a happy person. I think life is, it's too short to not appreciate uh, the smaller things in life. A lot of people just think that life is about making money. It's not, just remember this quote as well. Life cannot be replaced, money can. So remember family is always important. So I try and spend as much time with my family as I can and my friends as well. Now. I want to know your goals. A lot of people have goals, whether they're small goals or whether they're big goals. So if you guys have any goals, whether it be life goals or 2016 goals, leave them in the comment section down below. Now things are going to start to change on this channel a little bit, but I kind of wanted to give you guys a little bit of inspiration behind me. I was that guy who I would say, I'm not going to say oh, I was super popular. I knew everyone. I was pretty much popular in school because of football. I played football. I lived. I dreamed. I studied football. That was my life. Um, but at the same time, I did have gaming, and I came, I, ga I kept gaming hidden for a long time. It was kind of hidden in the drawer from everyone. But now that I go out, people know who I am. People find out that I make videos. And I guess overall, it's, it's a relief that people do understand it in a way. They would never ever expect it from me because of who I am and who I was. But that's, that's what life is about, you know? Never judge, a cover, never, never judge a book by its cover. So if you have something, whether it's a hidden talent, and you think that people are going to think it's stupid, don't. Because nine times out of ten, people will support you, the right people will support you, and it's going to take you far in life. So, I've been Scott. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the first vlog of 2016. Take care, stay beautiful, and as always, I'll catch you next time.